Assalamu alaikum guys how are you i hope you are doing good and uh, happy ramadan to everyone and i hope you are at your homes and all are safe and in this video i will show you a full review plus installation of hydrogen os for our Redmi 5 look at its boot animations it looks really dope as you can see here and uh, this rom is a port from the oneplus 6 its android version is 10 its uh, hydrogen version is 10.0.1 its security patch is first october 2019 i don't know why it is too old so without any further ado let's get started So first of all let's talk about the bugs and issues of this rom in this rom we only have two bugs first one is the bluetooth audio bluetooth is working fine but if you connect the bluetooth to any audio device then it will never work and the second one is the sd card content if you use any sd card in your device then it will never work in this rom so maybe this uh, uh these are the node major bugs and they will be fixed in future builds so except these errors or bugs everything is just working fine the overall performance is also good and in the launcher we have this oneplus launcher with some settings then we have widgets and wallpapers here we only have one wallpaper pre-installed you can get amazing live wallpaper from my previous videos and uh, the overall performance of this rom is also good as you can see here i have installed all my applications and they all are working good as you can see here the app opening speed of this rom is also good as you can see here it is opening the apps quickly and uh, it is asking for permissions and in the gallery we have this simple gallery application we don't have the oneplus gallery in this room and in the camera pre-installed we have the camera go in this room as you can see here this is a really good camera uh, like you can take your portrait images or you can take normal images and you can also enable the hdr mode to enhance the image quality you can record videos and you can also use the translate mode to translate anything using your camera and they will be working good so if you want to install any custom camera mode like gcam tr camera or any other camera mode then you can download and install from the link in the description they all are working good and the gaming performance of this rom is also good as you can see here, here we have the game space here that's mean you can play the games in this room laglessly. Now let's dig into the settings. And the settings first of all we have the search settings. Then we have some notification. Mobile data if you are having the uh, issue while enabling or disabling the mobile data. Then check the fixes from the description. And... Uh, if you are using two sims then just enter the settings go to Wi-Fi and internet then go to sim and network scroll down and from the mobile data choose any sim card and then again click on it and then choose the sim card where you want to use the mobile data then go to mobile data section and enable it this time you mobile data will be working fine and if you are using one sim card on your device then check the fix from the description then we have the display section here we have all uh, settings from the previous oneplus roms like do not mess with the phone size and display size it will uh, destroy your dpi After it we have the customization from here you can change the preset theme to vibrant illumination and the dark theme then you can set the wallpapers and cloak style but they are not working 
then you can change the accent color i am using the colorful tone that's why i can't change the accent color let's change the tone from the tone section from here you can manage the themes like dark theme or white theme and uh, then you can manage the accent colors from here you can also enable the dark theme uh, which is working fine now let's change the accent color as you can see here from here you can play with the color settings and then you can change the quick setting shape and you can also change the app icon shakes shapes and then you can change the font sizes and we have two font sizes pre-installed in this room so after it we have the sounds and vibration the sound quality of this room is also good then we have the buttons and gesture and the gestures and three button navigation bar everything is just working fine in this room every gestures is working good as you can see here and you can also hide the navigation bar pill to get the seamless full screen display which looks really amazing then we have some other settings and then we have apps and notification security and lock screen here every security is working good like fingerprint is working good pin is working good pattern lock is working good and uh, as you can see here it is unlocking the device quickly but here we ha also have the face unlock option but it is not working so maybe it will be fixed in future updates then we have privacy location battery the battery performance of this room is also good from here you can manage the battery optimization and battery saver then we have storage accounts google utilities here we have some advanced settings like parallel apps app locker and uh, other settings then we have system here we have accessibility languages and other settings here we also have the ram booster which will be helpful to manage the ram in this room then we have the about phone section from here you can check your device specifications then you can change your device name and uh, developer name the developer did really good work in this room and in the about phone uh, we have the android 10 pre-installed here its android version is 10 its security patch is uh, 1st october 2019 its hydrogen OS version is 10.0.1 so the ROM is pretty stable and you can test it if you want and uh, almost everything is just working fine so let me show you how you can install it and how you can make it to use as daily driver so first of all just download the hydrogen OS zip file from the link in the description which is the port rom from the oneplus 6 after downloading the zip file just reboot your device into any installed custom recovery the preferred recovery is xdoge twrp recovery you can reboot your device into custom recovery by pressing and holding power button plus volume up button After rebooting into TWRP recovery, go to wipe advanced wipe and wipe everything except the internal storage and SD card. Swipe to wipe. I am not going to wipe because I already installed it. Now go to install button and locate your downloaded ROM. Here we have the Hydrogen OS port ROM. Just click on it and install it like normal ROM and go to reboot. Click on system. The ROM will be installed so it will be a little laggy on first boot but it will be uh, normal soon so after installing the rom just uh, download the google play store apk file and google play services apk file from the link in the description and update the google play store and google play services to sign in into your google account then you can use it as your daily driver so hope you like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace